fear for your honest son, say face. Great chieftain, oh, the pudding race. Aboon them all, you take your place. Pinch, tripe, or theorem. Wheel are you worthy of grace, as lang's my error. The groaning trencher, there you fill. Your hurties, like a distant hill. Your pin would help to mend a mill. In time of need. While through your pores, thou dews distill. Like amber bead. His knife, see rustic labour dicht. And cut you up, where red is licht. Trenching your gushing ends of fright. Like only ditch. And oh, what a glorious sight. Warm, reeking, rich. Then, horn for horn, they stretch and strive. Deal tack the hindmost, on they drive. Till all their wheels, while they kites be alive, are bent like drums. And all good man may like to arrive. They thank it. Is there the hour is French ragout, or oleo would stow a sou, or fricassee would make her spew with perfect skinner? Look down with sneer and scorn for view on sick a dinner. Poor devil, see him hour his trash, as feckless as a withered rash, his spindle shank and beer which lash, his neve and knit, through bloody flood or field to dash. Oh, how unfit! But mark, the rustic hag is fed, the trembling earth resounds his tread, and clapping his wally neva blade, and he'll make it whistle, and legs and arms and heads will stead like taps of thistle. <laughs> <laughs> Ye powers, for me mankind your care, and dish them out their bill of fare. All oh, Scotland wants any skinking wear that jouts and luggies. But if you wish for grateful player, you're a haggis. <laughs>